Welcome back to CAD CAM tutorial. Today we are going to see how to sketch this planetary gear or gear driven mechanism in SOLIDWORKS. So we will see. Let's start. It is very good looking. Select new part. Choose assembly. OK. Cancel it. White plane. Now choose front plane. A sketch draw one circle from origin point draw one small circle the same as here two small circles now assign dimension keep diameter 100 mm now select this line circle and outer circle tangent this circle and this center circle tangent the same as this circle and this circle tangent and the smaller one and this line tangent okay select this both small circles make relation equal select this center point of all the circles make vertical okay now select the smart dimension and assign the dimension of a small circle 30 mm select okay now exit from the sketch now go to design library there is a toolbox and go down and choose ISO then select power transmission choose gear and select first spur gear keep module 2 20 number of teeth 20 pressure angle shaft dia keep 20 mm show t 20 select ok now it is asking uh, we want more than one piece no we need only one piece so just cancel it now see just click this part right click and select float Now go to assembly, choose mat, select this circle and select inside hole, co-centric, ok. Now select the front plane and back surface of this gear, see it is matched with front plane. Now click, right click on annotation, select display annotation show feature dimension now again go to library again choose spur gear number of teeth keep 15 20 12 Select shaft diameter 10 mm and 15 numbers. OK. And we want two pieces, so now cancel. Now this is the two pieces. Now select inside mat. OK. Select this face and this face. OK. Now select this inside radius select this circle ok now select this face and this face ok ok now select internal spur gear just drag and drop now it is asking keep module 2 number of teeth we want 50 
2012 outside diameter keep 110 mm teeth 50 select okay we want only one piece so cancel another now the same as select this circle choose mat select this surface okay now select this face and select this outer face okay now see normal now it is in one direction now right click on that display annotation uh hide now we hide the dimension now just adjust the gear the same as this also adjust okay this also adjusted now we will assign some relation go to mat choose mechanical gear now first select this is small one and this center one the smaller one keep 30 mm 40 mm select okay okay now see it is rotating adjust the gear space okay now go to mat again go to mechanical gear and select this time this center and this down this one keep 30 mm and this one keep 40 mm select okay now this time select this one and outer one choose gear select 100 mm and 30 mm choose reverse select okay okay now just rotate it see now this parallelly both rotating with see it is very beautifully rotating this is the beautiful gear now we will do animation for this gear so let's start now let's start the animation for this gear right click on this and choose motion motion studies go to office product choose Mo solid works motion and here choose motion analysis and right click on the orientation and camera view and select disable playback of key view okay now select motor select this 
center as a rotation and keep RPM 8 mm we want the small RPM select ok drag this up to 10 second just down and calculate now it is calculating calculation always fast now play see how the gears are working this is the beautiful planetary driven gear i hope you enjoyed this tutorial don't forget to share and like our videos and our channel for more projects in solidworks thanks for watching